Every year, teams comprised of students from across the nation apply to participate in the Tulane Business Model Competition. Advancing through three phases of business development, the teams are challenged to test their customer assumptions and evolve their products with the goal of learning the skills of a successful entrepreneur. In the Tulane Business Model Competition, students from across the nation are given a unique opportunity to test drive their ideas. They get feedback from faculty, from serial entrepreneurs, and from investors. And this is really critical to their process of developing and adjusting their ideas and finding out what really works. It's exciting to see these entrepreneurs develop their ideas through the Tulane Business Model competition. And what we've seen in past years is some of these ideas actually then come to market. And Dr. Jesse Rainey recognized the problem that a lot of pediatric patients with ventilation tubes in their eardrum have persistent eardrum ruptures. And therefore they have to receive major surgeries in order to resolve this problem. And he asked us, can you engineer something that can make this procedure easier? And we were working with light reactive hydrogels and that's how we came up with the idea for Perfix, our product. Well, we needed a platform, a way to share it with the world, and that's why we entered uh, the business model competition. Our students are involved in translational research, how one takes concepts from the laboratory and then creates devices and technologies that can work in the clinical environment. The business model competition allows them to articulate how that device or technology may transition to industry and the business aspects that might lead towards it being a good product. Have you learned how to network, how to introduce our product, and how to pitch to um, people who does not know anything about our product? And we learned we were capable of using what we had learned as PhD students and apply that in the business world. We came in first uh, in Tulane's business model competition and. Uh, that actually was the qualifier for um, international business model competition and uh, we uh, came in second in the international business model competition. In the past, students generally thought about themselves only going into academia, but culturally there's been a shift where some students find it very interesting to move into industry. And so having the skill set from the business model competition or from working with people in business and law School of Medicine improves their ability to work in the industrial environment and work with those in academia. It's all about finding out what works and what doesn't work, adjusting and trying again. You can't do this in a vacuum. You have to do this by taking your model out on the road and testing it. And that's exactly what the Tulane Business Model Competition allows students to do. So this feedback from experts and feedback from the market is really a critical component of success. But in all cases, the students develop new insights and capabilities that serve them throughout their careers, whether they're going to start companies or not. The Tulane Business Model Competition, fostering entrepreneurship and giving students invaluable real-life skills they can take into their future careers.